What is up, everybody? Wait, what? Happened to the pops? Why are they all? Why are they all? Wait a minute. Oh my gosh. So, I've been a little busy. Pops have changed, but that's not the main reason we're here today. Yeah, it's cool, different. I love it. But we are actually here today. Because I have been on vacation for about two weeks. I love doing this. I love sitting here in this spot. Um, and I got some new items to show you guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and bring them all. Um, these have all been here for a, a little while. Some of them are already out of the box. Some of them are not. Some one of them you have already seen. But, uh, yeah. Okay, here we go. Should we start with the stuff that I've already taken out of the box that like is not still in the package? So first, I've gotten two new sodas. I got Leonardo and Garfield. Both of these I found at five below. So, I mean, they're both commons. And um, this is the front of the one Garfield from last year. I didn't want to get it as soon as it came out. I wanted to, like, wait till it went on sale. It was the perfect time to get it. Leo, I have not been able to find anywhere. He's also the common. Would have been cool if they were chases, but hey, can't complain. Then, I've been on the hunt for this for a long time. This is the Hot Wheel <coughs> collector car. She guys are probably like, what does it have to do with Funko? Well, the collector in that little face that resembles right there is pretty much Freddy Funko. So everyone is calling this the Funko car. So I had to go looking for it and uh, I found it. That's right. Oh, okay. Next up, I got... The original Shaggy Pop. This Pop. Um. I don't. You might remember. Every year I go to this convention called Galaxy Con. Last year I got a Sonic Pop signed. This year I'm planning to meet Matthew Lillard and get this Pop signed. So there's definitely one that I was uh, needing. In order to get it signed. Yeah. Um. Let me get. A few more. Yes here they are. Okay, so, these are going to be coming in one by one. Not really going to be too far with these ones, but, as you know, I love Spongebob. So, uh, I went and pre-ordered the whole 25th anniversary set. And so far, I've gotten the Glove World Spongebob and Doodle Bob. So, 25th anniversary, I have this whole set pre-ordered and Hot Topic exclusive. Just waiting for them to come in. These two came out early for some reason. Doodle Bob, I actually want to pop them out of the box. Mostly because, like... <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> How cool is that? I'm just going to stab myself in the eye with the pencil. Wow. I'm actually in love with this. I'm in love with this. I'm just gonna let him sit up right, right there on the camera. Actually, no, I'm just gonna run it back in the box. Okay. Then, this is the pop right here that I probably won't be keeping in my collection. But uh, I found it, so I wanted to go ahead and pick it up. Um, cuts the. M&M slash B-Rabbit pop came out of box. Hopefully someday I can find one with the box. But for now, this is the one that we have in the collection. I'll put it up there with my other out-of-box pops. Okay, this one I'm, I'm really excited for. Because some of you guys might know about this one. Some of you guys might not. Back in February... Funko put out a pre-order on their website for 
this Jason Kelsey pop, which has been shipping out. So if you ordered one, it'll probably be coming in soon. So I wanna get one of the protector because that'd be there. There he is, Jason Kelsey with his shirt off. This is a cool one. I'm really in love with it. That sounded really weird. I like this pop a lot. Um, he's gonna be going somewhere special on this shelf, for sure. Okay. Oh, you guys have already seen this one. I did a YouTube short like a, few, like a week ago, I think, or whatever. Me finding the Paul McCartney pop. The the Beatles Yellow Submarine, Paul McCartney. Um, yes, yeah, so you guys have already seen this one before. But now we have these oh, three boxes. So let's, let's just crack into this one first. Okay, here he comes. Kind of rip the sides of the box. Okay, here we go. Ooh, yes. Okay, so this is the. This is another beetle. This is the George Harrison one. This is a very, all the Beatles are cool figures. Saying that they're old, you know, like, really hard to find. Um, yeah, so I'm going to be trying to complete the whole set right in the back, right there. I believe John Lennon should be in one of these boxes. Don't really know which one, so I guess we're just going to and crack open the next box. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, I did not know about this, but uh, in this box we uh, oh my gosh. Okay, well, bubble wrap. Wow. Okay, so, Mr. Eminem right here now has a brother. <laughs> Ain't no way. Gas crazy. Oh, well, there you have it. I got inbox Eminem. So I guess this guy is just going to be hanging out. This is awesome. Okay, this I did not know. Um, me and my dad were hunting on eBay to get the Beatles. Don't really know when he got this, but uh, that's awesome. B Rabbit slash Eminem inbox pop is not my collection. So this last box should be, and yes, it is, the John Lennon. What? Oh, uh, the John Lennon. Box. Yep, it is. Bubble wrap. Got it. <laughs> Bubble wrap. Got to love it. That was a. Yeah, there he is. These are very old. Never did I think I'd ever have these. There he is, John Lennon. Um. So, as of this, right now I'm recording this, me and my dad are hunting for the Ringo Star. We can have all four Beatles, and then probably the Blue Meanie eventually. Oh, wait, one more thing. I forgot. I forgot about the last thing. Duh. Okay. Oh, that 
that's a big bot. I can't. Oh. You gotta give me a sec, but then I can uh, grab this last one. Okay. okay, now we are gonna <coughs> go ahead and grab the last box. Oh my god, this is a big one. Okay. This right here is so we put in for the, I don't even know if I'll be able to get this out. Um, for the, is it in the bottom? Oh, no, it's, here, you can help me. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, here we have the Jumbochon Speed Racer. Final figure. This is big. So this figure, I don't think it works. Maybe it's the easy way. Okay. This figure was limited. Oh, well, there's a figure on the back if you don't know what it looks like. Um, this figure was limited to 1,000. 200 pieces. Um, 14 inches. So let's see what it looks like out of box. If I can uh, slide out. Yeah, it does. His, this is like very big. You, you, you can try. It slides out the bottom. <laughs> Please hold. Heads out on the bottom. A very good, very tightly packed, so good job on that, Funko. Should just come out now. Okay. There we go. Got it open. Finally. Um, as soon as you open it up, you have the certificate of authenticity. Here. The speed racer. Are they numbered? I don't even know. No, they're not. Okay, here. Take off the little mold. And um uh, here is the Speed Racer Jumbo Chon figure. Right here. Wow. This is massive. Also, just a quick, uh, quick shout out to my dad for uh, helping me get this open. And for while I was gone, getting all these pops from the mail. Yeah, so this is the Jumbo. They weren't wrong about one thing. This is Jumbo. Um, this is the Speed Racer Jumbo Tron. As soon as me and my dad put in for this, like, I wanted it, but then I'm like, I might not get it. So then, when the results came out, and uh, it said we got it, we're like, ain't no way. So this is a piece that is very limited right here. It's only like 1,200. I actually want to take a look at this art in this um, certificate. It is, this is authentic. You can 
not no fake. This is cool. Like, even just getting the certificate is cool. Because, like, like, this is a real figure. I feel like, like, as much as it would be hard, I feel like all pops that are, like, rare or, like, have piece counts. Is there an example I can show? Possibly anywhere. For example, I think he's off screen is he sorry guys i can't find him here he's off camera he's he's right here my snoop dog pop is limited to fifteen thousand pieces i like the piece counts because it makes it a little more loaded but some of the older ones like i get it was old funko example the beatles there are so many fakes in the world that i feel like like okay I take this back right as I say because you can authentic. Um, I don't know what what to use for it, but it is possible to get your pops authenticated. Mostly signatures authenticated. Like I have three signed pops. Two of the three I actually met and got them signed in person. The other one I got on eBay, but it does have the certificate of authenticity. So that was nice. But, um, so there you have it. This is my massive Funko Pop haul. Um, haven't usually done, a, I haven't done a haul in a long time. But, um, shout out today. If you want more Funko in the future, like I always will probably do, um, hit the subscribe button. And like and comment. And uh, see you guys in the next one. Peace.